I think two things uh, would make a big difference. First, Californians have essentially outsourced their governance uh, to professional politicians. Edmund Burke said that for bad things to happen, all that's necessary is for good people to do, to do nothing. And that's happened in California, where we have 38 million people uh, who elect 120 legislators. Those legislators are professionals generally. Many are not even numerate enough to fully understand the budget. Virtually all of them are beholden to special interest, more concerned about what their next job is or what their future is than the future of their own state. And you have people in the state uh, who think they know something about what's going on about politics, but they've outsourced their governance to people, and they don't even, uh, even know their legislator. I can't tell you how many times I have uh, asked my friends, who's your state assemblyman? Who's your state senator? And they don't even know the name of that person, even though we have only 120 of those, and they allocate $120 billion a year of taxpayer money. So we need, like any good business, like any good nonprofit, it all starts with the people. We need better people in government. And so we need people to get involved, run for office, work for people, and become citizen legislators. The other thing we need is transparent and honest accounting. Anybody who has been in business or a nonprofit who's ever had to manage an income statement or a balance sheet is stunned when they look at state accounting, where things are not allocated or reported based upon first principles, like how much goes to salary, how much goes to benefits, how much goes to occupancy costs, and that sort of thing. But instead, it's all programmatic. How much goes to corrections? How much goes to health and human services? Without people asking the question, well, within corrections, how much is going to compensation? And how much is going to benefits? When they learn that, they realize that we spend $9 billion a year on corrections, and $7 billion of that, or $6 billion of that, is going to compensation and benefits. Uh, for 65 or 70,000 employees. If you had good accounting done by the controller or the treasurer or the legislative analyst's office uh, or others uh, that would make sure that people knew what, what, where the money was going and where it was ending up, that would make a big difference in government.